Hello everyone and welcome back to the series of MATLAB and Simulink tutorial. Today we will implement sampling of a cost signal in MATLAB. In the given task we have a signal x of t which is equal to 10 cos of 2 pi tan t. And for sampling we will use an impulse train and here the sampling frequency will be equal to 30 hertz which is more than 2 times of the highest frequency as per Nyquist criteria. Now we will move to MATLAB for implementation. We will start MATLAB code with some basic clearing instruction and then we will construct signal x of t which have a frequency of 10 hertz and then we will define time vector and signal x of t. In the second part we will take Fourier transform of x of t using the fft command. Now for impulse train first of all we will define the sampling frequency and we will define a vector of zero values. Now to this vector of zero values we will assign a value of 1 where n over fs is an integer. Then we will take Fourier transform of impulse train. Now for sampling of cost signal, we will use multiplication in time domain or we can use convolution in frequency domain. Here we are using multiplication in time domain. And we will again take the Fourier transform of the sample signal. Now we will run the simulation and we will have two figure. Figure 1 have all the time domain responses where figure 2 have all the frequency domain response. In figure 1, first plot is the x signal x of t, where second one is impulse train and in third figure we have sample signal in red color, where in figure 2, first plot is magnitude response of signal x of t, where second plot is magnitude plot of impulse train and in last we have frequency domain response of sample signal. Thanks for watching the video, this was all about today and stay connected for more videos.